Yesterday I was trying to do mod bus communication. This side was not easy. With the mod bus, sometimes it's very straightforward, but sometimes mod bus can get very tricky and it can hurt you badly. Before we talk further about today's topic, if you haven't subscribed to this YouTube channel, consider subscribing. Turn your notification on if you don't want to miss any future video. I was trying to communicate with customer DCS system through Modbus and it took a lot of time. You can say that almost whole day. But somehow I fixed that problem and I got connected with the customer DCS system through Modbus. And in multinational culture, the companies cares only about the work output they don't care how much you sit in the office i took off advantage of doing that job and i leave early when i was traveling back to the home i was thinking about that problem suddenly i realized there was something need to be corrected in modbus configuration right away on the go i started i opened up my laptop and started fixing the problem when i did that out of improvement what happened amazingly I lost the connection with the site. Then I get back to the home, I started working with that and it took and it takes almost whole night to fix the problem again. What I want to tell you from this story is as an automation engineer, as a control engineer, as an IIoT industrial digitalization engineer, your brain is not free. Even with your you are with the family, you are sometimes thinking about some problem you're thinking how to fix it you're thinking about how you're going to execute the next project and another advice i have no matter how you fix that problem if things are working out don't mess up again like the site was working perfectly fine i thought of having a better way to solve the problem and i started looking into that and the result was it took almost all the night to solve that problem a lot of people get inspiration from this youtube channel and most of the people think that being an automation control dcs plc engineer the one thing that you have in your life is comfort happiness money and good life as an automation engineer you should keep in your mind sometimes automation can get very tricky and challenging especially when you do some communication thing, Modbus, Profibus, Profinet. After, after knowing about the struggle I have, would you still like to be an automation engineer? Do let me know in the form of the comments. That's all for today. If you like this video, consider hitting the like button. If you haven't subscribed to this YouTube channel, consider subscribing. Until next video, take care and Allah Hafiz.